he's never actually bought men shorts before i don't know if he likes them i don't know if he doesn't i don't know if it's just a personal preference thing each time i make a memory then i try to make it with you good morning besties we're going out to the mall real quickly with Cable's a bunny i need to get a frame first of all for my uct certificate that was so underwhelming i swear i expected so much more but it looked like regular paper but still it is still relevant okay 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 go try it whoa literally says wave to change color and yes we are the people who are standing here outside the woolies christmas display when you go here it's blue when you go to <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Love it. I think she might never want to leave. Well done, Willie's on that Christmas display. Pretty catchy. This is essentially the photo frame I'm looking for. I think this should fit an A4 paper, right? Let me check the centimeters on an A4 paper. I'm gonna quickly ask Google. It's 21 by 30. Yeah. Oh shoot, that's 20 by 30. Yeah, that should be fine still. Hey, <laughs> what's John doing? Yeah. I'm gonna get a white one because the paper color is off white. We've been looking for a washing line for so long, and I'm seeing this one here at Mr. Price Home, but it's that stainless. It's not, is it stainless steel? I don't know, I can't tell. It's $3.99, which is not entirely bad because normally with the other ones, the 200 ones from Checkers, the lines here. They go loose and then it kind of looks all wonky. Dizzy should buy us the washing line. What do you think? Why don't we send him a photo? Let's send him a photo, you're right. Let's do that. I need you to go in here and pick whatever you want. Make sure it's the right age and throw it in the trolley. I take the lead? Yeah, you take the lead. I'll just follow you. Can you go in the big girl side? This is kind of the big girl side and mostly this way here. Oh, okay. Yeah. You like that one? Okay, check the size. Check the, remember to check the size. Uh, the size nine, we need a 10. Okay. Get it out and then check here. You must always check on this label thingy. Because sometimes the hanger is just telling its own thing, see? We sorry. You look at things that you think you'll be comfortable in for one that you think you're gonna be able to play nicely in and then we check the prices. That glittery dress is really awesome but where are you gonna wear it to? Do you think it's a dress you can wear to the park? <laughs> That's true, you can't wear it to the park. So maybe this yellow one, because it looks really cool, or the one behind the glittery one, because that's the pineapple one, because that, that also looks really nice. I need to take off my shoes. There's so much laundry just hovering around this house needing to be folded. Oh my god. Hi. <laughs> you scared me. <coughs> I do want to watch a movie, but I need to frame my expensive paper. You did it? Oh my god. Did Daddy teach you? Thank you, Daddy. Did you thank Daddy? Bye. Love you. Come back if she's not there. I just finished. I'm going to have a real look at it. Oh my god. Oh my god, it looks so good. Honey, that looks absolutely perfect. Mm. Are you ready? Mm. Let me see. Whoa. Right? Now it's A3. It's straight up just upscaled the whole thing. Mm. It's gonna fit here. This mm. is its spot. Right here. We're going to wait for Peanut and Olinos to wake up from their nap so that we can do a little hole, a little nail on the wall so we can hang the certificate officially. Oh, but it looks so good. That white frame is everything. And I almost got the one with the wooden frame, but that wasn't going to work quite as well. I'm going to keep my transcript in there so one day I can take a photo like this. So I'll hire a graduation gown and a cap. And I'll do this. I don't know when that's gonna be, but it is what it is. Yeah, even if you doubt me now, you should know I don't care about the things you say. I want to quickly show you guys 
our huge clothing haul because we just went crazy at Woolies. To be honest, the plan was to just buy clothes for me because I haven't bought clothes for myself in so long and I feel like the clothes I have, they are not necessarily representing the me now. I mean, I'm not changing my style, it's just the clothes because back then I used to buy things because they're cute and now I'm buying things because they look good on me. That's a huge difference. We have got two giant waist bags and then Oh my god, another huge one. Let's do the kids clothing item first and then we'll move over to me. First we're gonna do Keep It Bunny. She picked everything for herself. I let her pick the clothes she wanted and all I said was look at the sizing, check the price. If you're comfortable with that price, then we'll buy it. If you feel like it's too expensive, we're not buying it. If you feel like, you know, it needs to be negotiated, negotiate away. And she did pretty amazing for the most part. She really did. Considering this was her first official shopping experience clothing wise, I think she did really good. She picked up this pink tie-dye like t-shirt. It's got two little smiley faces. This one's got that sequence material here, which is really, really nice and it's got little jiggly bits at the bottom which I think is officially what draw her to it. This pair of denim shorts, I did have to help her a little bit with pairing because she wasn't too sure what I was talking about when I said find a t-shirt and find the bottoms to pair with that t-shirt. It's got that adjustable waistband which is really really nice because a belt is not always a good idea when it comes to kids especially because they always wait until the very last minute before they go pee. It's a crop top light but it's also like a regular t-shirt and it just says happy day happy day happy day and happy mind happy life which I think is really really cute. This little skirt that she absolutely adored. Oh yeah and it was also the pockets. She is totally my best friend's kid this one. My late best friend she loved anything and everything with pockets. She rubbed that off Kay Bear, that's for sure. Obviously she's gonna put shorts underneath it, like not not short shorts, like little leggings that we cut up to make shorts so that when she's playing and running around in the park, her underwear is not exposed. High dye leggings. This is literally the first item she went for. And these she's gonna match with this regular pink t-shirt. Has got the little pocket right there. So these two together will match, which is really, really nice. And then the last item she has is this little yellow dress. Yellow looks so good on her. It just brightens her up. And this is gonna be nice and flowy on her. She can totally wear this on Christmas day or whenever she wants to, but it's really, really cool. That's that for Kate Little Bunny. I'm gonna show you guys what we got for Nolly Nolls, but before then I need to change my camera battery because it's just like Flashing, flashing, flashing. For Nolly Nolls, we got, this is a three pack t-shirt. It gives me Christmas feels. The first one says be kind. This one doesn't have anything. This one's got that. Got this in a size three years old instead of two. I like this little bows on the shoulder. It's not necessarily for resizing. This is just decoration. But again, it's really, really super cute. I like that. I paired that with its regular recommended pairing. This is a three pack as well. And with these, you can get so many different options. Nobody wants to do laundry every single day. But at the same time, nobody wants their kid to be wearing bland and boring clothes every single day to school, you know? You want them to still be fun, but be practical. <laughs> and you can never go wrong with leggings. You really can never go wrong with leggings. I got the leggings in size two years old because that will fit. If it's three years old, then the waist gets bigger and it becomes a whole other story. On the dresses, they had these by two and save. The first one I picked up for her is this one. It just says be kind. I don't know how they're gonna fit her now because they're size two, but she's also a little bit tall, so they should still be okay different rainbow color ones and it's got little pockets that says stay happy keep smiling live simple i think it's really really cute and i'm here for the little bows on the shoulders too and then the last dress she has is this one that says yay also little cute stuff on the shoulders anyway that's it for nolly nose and then for little mr peanut this two pack pants just the black ones and these little gray ones. It's hard. It's really hard to find plain t-shirts for boys. I know now though that pick and pay is my go-to. They always have solid plain colored t-shirts for boys. When I buy him pants, I always keep it in mind to say I'm gonna buy solid colored pants so that if we do buy t-shirts that have got dinosaurs or whatever, he doesn't look like busy on busy with the bottoms. So that's always my logic. This was a two-pack by the way, both of them. So this is denim and this one is the beige one and they all got drawstrings willies did the most this this is what i love the nice thing with peanuts is that next year he's gonna be wearing uniform to school but it's not compulsory to wear uniform every single day so i'm thinking if we just get him two pair 
of school uniform shorts and three t-shirts so then she wears he wears the uniform mondays wednesdays and fridays and then tuesdays and thursdays he can wear casual wear then we are good we don't have to spend extra money buying like extra ridiculous amount of school clothes so i went ahead and i got him this two-pack t-shirt this one is the iguana iguana go surfing which i think is really cute and then this military like which would look super cool with like denim shorts this one just gray keep smiling dude like i said boy t-shirts it's really hard to find just a regular plain one but that one is a dinosaur so heck yeah and then it goes with this little stripy one which i think is really really cool that is all i got for the kids i am gonna go ahead and show you guys what i got for me oh my god it's heavy first thing i got for myself was this little pocket wallet thing because i always use my side bag and i hate that i have to dig through my side bag for what feels like forever every time looking for my bank cards and stuff so in here i can just throw stuff in there and be able to know where it is i picked up this t-shirt that i haven't tried i like this little details here on the thingy on the sides i like that it's like the off the shoulder it's 100 percent cotton the shell the lining the lace everything about this is cotton i've actually never had like chino like shorts so i picked up these they have pockets here which is really nice i'm thinking here at home running errands picking kids up at school looking cute going out i actually can wear this top with these shorts and put on like nice sandals and go out for drinks with a friend or do whatever and then i got me a mom short i don't know what's a mom short but it says ultra high rise de-stressed acid wash so that's what i got that's the distress they are talking about i got two pairs of pajamas nice little lacy details down there and then i got the solid blue ones basically same thing just different color jeans oh my god these are the most comfortable pair of jeans i've put on in a long time they are called boyfriend jeans they are mid-rise which is really really nice and it's like distressed here by the knees even though it kind of sort of goes a little bit below my knees because i'm short short girl problems and this i got in a size eight and it fits perfectly this one is just a regular curvy skin it's ultra high rise it's designed to fit your waist with no gap and i got this one in a size 10 just because it's a skinny jean i loved the way it looked on me so i went ahead and i got it it is distressed over here and i got this little t-shirt again 100 cotton v-neck down there i love that it's flowy so it's not going to be too tight around my tummy and then i got this regular one this is just a regular t-shirt it's like the ones i bought recently but this one is a v-neck which makes it even more cool so it's this one and this one they are literally the same thing and then i got oh yeah this is for daisy base i was like what is that so i got these these shots see the thing with daisy is he's never actually bought men shorts before i don't know if he likes them i don't know if he doesn't i don't know if it's just a personal preference thing but i always feel bad when i buy all these things for us and i never get him anything so i was like i'm gonna buy him these one pair of shorts to get a feel for his reaction to see how he reacts and obviously for him to let me know honestly what he feels like so i got him these pair of chino shorts it's slim fit i know he loves slim fits and i got it in a size 34 length 87 i don't know what that means to be quite quite honest i'm thinking he can wear this with his like black t-shirt or a white little t-shirt the ones that he already has and pretty much just take it from there and the last thing i got was these little um, slip-ons for me bedazzled obviously they're really, really cute i think these are coming back in style which is so weird i don't know if you guys have noticed but all the things that we grew up with during our times like the 90s they're coming back now it's so weird i don't know if that means we are old because from what i know it's always been saying our parents stuff our parents used to wear this our parents this, did this our parents did that and now we're like wait i used to wear that when i was growing up and now it's back so yeah i think we kind of swear at that point now that's all i got that's all the clothing that we have um i hope you guys enjoyed watching this vlog i think i'm gonna leave it here because that is way too many things <laughs> i'm gonna go see if the kids are awake um if not we're probably just gonna catch a movie and relax and wait for them to wake up so they can eat their noodles i've uh, never seen you wearing shorts before huh? i've never seen you wearing shorts before yo 